Hi, my name is Hilda. Hi, and my name is Stella. And we work as advisors at Section for International Relations. We are passionate about internationalization, and we hope that precisely you will seize one or more of the many opportunities that we can offer at NHH to work in an international company or study at one of our recognized partner universities abroad. No universities or university colleges in Norway send more students on exchange than NHH, and we intend to continue doing just that. This year has been so far a very exceptional and different uh, year for, for very many of us. Um, here at the, uh, the Section for International Relations, we, we are still working on our opportunities opportunities that we'd like to offer you and today we'd like to present some of them uh, to you and we hope you uh, we hope you like them. So why should you get an international education? Today most workplaces are international or will at some point require you to cooperate on international projects. When choosing to study abroad uh, through NHH you may choose from some of the world's best universities in university colleges and take courses which may not be available in Norway. Many of these schools are extremely hard to get into, but through our agreements, you get a unique opportunity to get a top education. It could give you the chance to learn a cutting edge subject from a renowned professor and add a special touch to your NHH degree. Through our partnership agreements, we have negotiated good deals so that in many cases you don't have to pay school fees or you get reduced rates. When you live abroad and get to know fellow students and lecturers on campus, you build networks that can help you later in life if you want an international career. Living in a country where the language is spoken is the best way to learn the language and it allows you to get in touch with the locals. Lorna Kosten has one of the world's best student financing schemes and offers you loans and scholarships for language courses if you want to study in a language other than English. In addition, you receive support for travel, accommodation, and tuition. And scholarships from Erasmus Plus may come in addition to this, depending on where you decide to go. Then we have uh, soft skills and cultural skills. And you get uh, invaluable uh, soft skills and cultural skills by living in another country. You may learn that the values and ways of doing things that you took for granted may not work everywhere. To be honest, Norway is an odd country when it comes to social norms. We're in first name with the boss. We may wear jeans and shorts at work, and we are very egalitarian and formal. To a degree that we may be perceived as rude, uh, in an international context. Most other countries are much more formal and are also very hierarchical in working life. And learning cultural codes as a student or an intern will give you lots of benefits if you want to work internationally. Then you have self-development. You learn so much about yourself when you have to adapt, uh, adapt to a new environment and culture. When you pull away from everything and everyone you know, uh, and you have to build a network from scratch and handle things on your own, you gain a whole new confidence and belief that you can handle other challenges as well. And then we have the career benefits, of course. Uh, having international experience tells potential employers that you take initiative, that you are adaptable and tolerant, and that you can take on a challenge. And last but not least, uh, living abroad is incredibly fun and enriching, and you'll make memories and friends for life. Uh, you can take a semester on exchange at one of our over 170 partner schools around the world. You take a total of 30 credits on exchange, which you will get recognized into your degree when you get home. Uh, 22.5 uh, of these credits will be within your minor, and then you take electives of 7.5 credits. You can go on exchange within the standardized uh, study period of two years, so four semesters, and uh, 
basically it means that you go on exchange in your third or fourth semester um, unless you have all taken a bachelor at NHH then you may also go on exchange in the second semester um, you may not go on exchange uh, after the fourth semester regardless of whether you have been an active student during the previous semesters or not we recommend students to travel in the third semester and this is because if something should happen in, while you're on exchange so that you don't get uh, enough credits, you will still have the opportunity to take up subjects without having to take an extra semester when you should be starting your new job. The deadline for application uh, is uh, 1st of February uh, and this is for both fall and spring exchange. Uh, if you want more information um, about student experiences and practical tips on exchange, you can look at our student reports in Canvas. You will find these um, in the course International Opportunities at NHH, in which you can enroll yourself in Canvas. The SEMS Master in International Management is an internationally recognized master's program that has been named one of Europe's best management programs by Financial Times. In the SEMS program, you take one regular year at NHH, one semester with SEMS courses at NHH, one semester on exchange, and an international internship of at least eight weeks. Jan Holland will give a special presentation on SEMS and will tell you more about what you need to know. Getting a double degree is a great opportunity to get two master's degrees in two years and spend one whole year at one of our partner institutions. You take your first year at NHH and the second year abroad, and you then get two degrees and two diplomas. The program is available for all main profiles in MOA, but not for our MRR. And on the next page, you can see a list of our seven partner schools that you can choose from in the double degree program. The application deadline is November 1st. The Nordic Center at the Fudan University in Shanghai is a joint project between Fudan University and several schools in the Nordic countries. Every year we send three students on a summer course at the Nordic Center to give the students firsthand knowledge of China. The two courses available are Business and Innovation in China and Chinese Politics and Society. The courses run over two weeks each and correspond to five ECTS. The credits may not be included in your degree at NHH, but you will receive a course certificate from the Nordic Center. The application deadline will be in the beginning of March. Another opportunity for international experience in the summer is Grinderschulen, or the Entrepreneurial School. The Entrepreneurial School is an award-winning summer program for those who want to learn more about entrepreneurship and business development in some of the world's best innovation environments in Boston, San Francisco, Singapore, Toronto, or Houston. This is a collaborative project between several large educational institutions in Norway which is coordinated by the University of Oslo. This course runs over 10 weeks and focuses on starting a business, so it complements the innovation school. At Grinda School, you can choose to have the course approved as an elective of 7.5 credits or as a support profile of 30 credits. This means that you can combine this with an exchange if you choose to fit it as an elective. Now Stella is going to talk about international career opportunities. Thank you, Hilda. Um, so I work in NHH's International Career Centre together with uh, a colleague of mine, Anne-Marie, that I'm sure you'll get to know. Uh, our focus is today, as it always is, um, interna uh, international work experience for our students, how we can assist you in acquiring this if you're interested in an international uh, career. These are exceptional times we are uh, experiencing at the moment, but uh, we know from the, the contact that we have with our partner companies that they are very keen on staying in touch with, uh, with our students and are looking for different ways of doing this. 
Uh, in this presentation now onwards, uh, I'll talk a little, about, little bit about different ways that you can do this. Now, the first uh, important step, uh, step that we recommend for you to, to, to go ahead and do is uh, enroll yourself on our job platform, Job Teaser. And you'll find this a link to this platform on our websites. Um, this is a very good and efficient way of staying on touch, in touch uh, with us. And on top of the information that we, um, we uh, publicize um, about uh, job opportunities and events that we organize also. So please uh, check this out. Then we'd like to mention our fairly new uh, introduced course, Internship Abroad. Uh, this has a bachelor and a master version uh, of the course um, where you can integrate an international in, uh, internship in your degree here from NHH, either on a bachelor or on a master level. Uh, Norwegian students are required to work uh, abroad for a minimum of four weeks and international students may undertake their internship in Norway and have that uh, deemed as their international experience. Our major components of the course uh, are inter inter uh, intercultural communication and economics and administration. Now you can find your own uh, internship and in that case you'll need to have it approved by the, uh, by the International Career Centre uh, or you can approach us to learn more about the opportunities that we provide our students uh, with through the contact and agreements that we have with our, our corporate partners. So we've just mentioned a few of them here. They're very exciting opportunities. One major and very important event that the Student Union organises every year are the Career Days. They take place uh, every autumn for four days uh, and consist of three days first of courses and lectures on uh, the job market, smart career moves, skills that you need to acquire. Uh, and they're held by, by companies mostly. Uh, the ICC, the International Career Centre, also um, provides courses uh, every year. And this year we're working that, uh, on a CV building course and also uh, a course with a title Toolkit for Working Abroad. The last day of the, uh, of the career days is the uh, career fair itself with lots of stands with over 100 companies. Um, where you can get in touch with the companies directly and introduce yourself. Um, of course, we're not quite sure what this is going to look like in the autumn, in September, what the situation in the world will be, but uh, we in, uh, encourage you to stay updated on the Student Union's um, uh, webpage for this, uh, for this event. One example of a cooperation that we have with uh, one of our corporate partners is uh, Bank of America. Uh, now for the past couple of years, they have attended uh, the career days. Now this is an opportunity for you to introduce yourself and get to know them. Um, following the uh, career days, they uh, offer a workshop in, it has been organized in London and in Stockholm and also an internship. Uh, so this is a brilliant, uh, brilliant opportunity for NHH students to, to grab. Uh, and please do approach us if you are interested in this uh, opportunity and would like some CV assistant or, or assistance in uh, job interview techniques. We'd love to hear from you. More websites for you to stay informed and inspired uh, through Instagram with uh, and also on our websites with information on our different uh, opportunities that are, are available. Um, please read up on these and also we would love to hear from you, be get in touch uh, with you. Uh, there are different ways of doing this. Um, here you can see a list of our um, the different uh, email addresses for different topics um, and we've also added a link uh, that will take you to a web page uh, with a complete overview of uh, all our um, uh, contact hours. In these times, we're available on telephone and online. We very much look forward to hearing from you. Uh, please do get in touch. Thank you for joining us. Thank Bye. you. Bye-bye.